Oh my gosh, okay, it has been a whirlwind of a morning. I'm trying to get in some good lighting here. I wanna show you my little ooted <laughs> outfit of the day. Um, we have to head out the door in literally five minutes and some are still eating breakfast, so yikes. But yeah, I wanted to show you my little outfit. I have these new sneakers. My sister got them for me for Christmas. I'll try to find the link and put them down below. This jacket's from Abercrombie & Fitch. It's like one of their shackets. Um, and yeah, we are going to Summer's 18 month appointment. Sorry if you hear Blue's Clues in the background. We're going to her 18 month appointment. She's like almost 20 months. I don't know why the scheduling got the way it is. It's just a checkup. So we'll take you along on that. I did lighten my hair and I think in this light it looks really, really light. I don't know, let me know what you guys think quickly before we go though i am going to take my vitamins this has been a new year's resolution for me to get back on track with taking my vitamins and health and all of that stuff i've been trying to drink more water eat healthy and with that comes taking vitamins and i found this company called you natural they actually create like vitamin blends i guess you could call it so i am taking vitex which is supposed to promote hormone regulation and if you guys watched my video um the pregnancy test video from about a month ago i talked a little bit about how my cycles have always been irregular so i'm hoping that this helps it's actually really interesting i got my period within five weeks from my last one which is way more on schedule than normal for me normally i'm like six weeks here seven sometimes like longer which is why i took a pregnancy test um so that's really cool. I guess it's this chaste tree berry, which is supposed to help with the hormone regulation. The Vitex can also help with hot flashes, excess weight gain, and lack of energy. And I've also been taking their Biotin Hair, Skin, and Nails supplement too. I'm sure you guys are familiar with Biotin, but I really like getting it from You Natural because this Biotin is supposed to be especially pure, more pure than other Biotins on the market. It's supposed to be really, really good for hair growth, strong, nails and glowing skin. I will put a link in my description box if you guys are interested. Thank you so much to You Natural for sponsoring this video. The capsules are really, really easy to swallow too. Like if you're used to like massive prenatal vitamins, um, these are nothing compared to that. These are also hypoallergenic and never tested on animals. Their vitamins are all blended in the USA too, which I think is awesome. They are wheat, gluten, and dairy-free, I believe, and also egg-free. So if and when I get pregnant again and then breastfeed and need to be on that diet, the same one I was with Summer, um, for her milk and soy protein intolerance, these will be safe to take, which is awesome. They have a ton of other options too. And you can get these off of Amazon, which is awesome. So if you have an Amazon Prime membership, you can get these in a couple days or you can get them from their website. Um, and I've even seen them on the Walmart website. I'm not sure if they're in store at Walmart, but um, they're very easy to find online. So I'm just gonna take one of each and we are gonna get going. Where's my water? I don't know where my water is. So I'm just gonna get some. I have both in my mouth. down the hatch. They also told me what people can do if you really have an issue swallowing pills, which I don't think you will with these, but just in case you are really sensitive, you can open up the capsules and pour the contents into like a smoothie and blend it up. I also recommend maybe getting one of these pill, uh, weekly pill dispensers or uh, pill boxes. I haven't filled this up yet, but I think now that I'm doing a better job of taking my vitamins, I'm gonna start doing this weekly. A lot of times I will forget if I even took them uh, on a certain day, so it's just really easy if you use one of these, so. Okay, I actually got her in the car fairly quickly, so I figured I would just share with you guys what I plan to ask the doctor. I always put together a list on my notes app of questions that I have for the doctor. So I wanna ask about um, potty training. Uh, summer is, like I said, uh, almost 20 months. So I don't think we're gonna fully, fully start until she's two, but I wanna ask if there's anything we should be doing now. I wanna ask about um, teeth brushing because she, we have her brush her teeth every night, but I don't know if we should be doing it in the morning too or like things like that. 
Um, I want to ask about vitamins. I want to see if she should be taking any vitamins. I'm going to ask about her sound machine. Um, we've always used a sound machine and it's fairly loud, so I just want to make sure that we shouldn't be like weaning her off of that. And I want to ask about TV time. Um, I shared with you guys in our last vlog that I am um, I have limited her TV time to like an hour a day, but there's definitely days where I go over that and I kind of just want to see what our doctor's opinion is on TV time for um, a toddler her age. So those are the things that I plan to ask and I just kind of wanted to share that with you in case you have a toddler the same age um, and maybe want to ask your doctor about those things too. But we're going to get going. Our appointment's at 9 o'clock and it's like 8.50 and the doctor's like 10 minutes away so we're probably just going to make it on time so we'll catch you there. Yeah, I know. The door's right there, though, so you'll be right in. Okay. Okay. We've got you all layered up, don't we? Hold my hand. Hold my hand. Okay, we just got out of the doctor's. It was a great visit. Um, Summer's doing awesome. She's in the 90th percentile for height and weight. And I got answers to a lot of my questions. So TV time, two hours, which I know I had read online too, but two hours is kind of like the max screen time. So I think as long as we're in between one and two hours, we should be good. Um, I asked about potty training and we really don't have to start that until two, but I think I might start to get her familiarized with her little potty. And we've also done a few things just to prepare for that, which I will show you later in the video um, in this vlog and teeth brushing we're fine with just brushing at night the doctor said um, no vitamins yet which I guess I was kind of surprised by but she said as long as summer is eating fruits and vegetables and like healthy foods it's really not necessary and I think that's everything um, I did ask about her sound machine and if that's okay even though she's like getting older like is that going to become a crutch for her and she said definitely not it's not an issue at all um yeah they do an autism screen at this 18 month appointment and summer has no signs of that i know i mentioned in my last vlog i was a little bit worried about her sound sensitivity um i was making a smoothie and using the blender and i showed you guys kind of summer's reaction to that she doesn't cry anymore she did when she was little she just gets really scared and kind of comes over to me but the doctor said that that's totally fine and normal like as long as she's not losing her mind over most sounds like you know plates banging um just daily sounds if it's something really really loud it's fine so that made me feel better even though i knew that she probably didn't have an issue there but yeah that's the quick recap of our doctor visit there is a new starbucks drive through uh in town literally 30 seconds up the road so i think i'm gonna go through the drive through as long as it's not too too long and get us a fun treat summer loves the butter croissants from there and i'm gonna get myself a coffee and maybe something because i didn't get to finish my coffee since this morning was crazy with getting her ready for the doctor and getting myself ready and all of that so we're gonna hit up starbucks and then go home it's almost lunchtime like 45 minutes until lunchtime so we need to get home for that and then summer will take her nap and yeah i'll just kind of vlog the rest of the day it is my sister's birthday today so tonight we're going over to my parents house for dinner um i'll show you the gifts i got her so yeah stay tuned The line is super, super long. Um, we don't have a drive through Starbucks anywhere near where I live. There's one 
like maybe five, 10 minutes away from here. And then there's one in the Target near us. But I had a feeling that this place is gonna be crazy because it's just so nice to have a drive through especially on a snowy day like this. So yeah, we're just waiting in line. I honestly have no idea what I'm gonna order. I've been kind of bored with my Starbucks order lately. I've just been getting a vanilla latte very vanilla <laughs> uh, yeah kind of boring so I think I might switch it up um, I also forgot to mention from summer's appointment she's doing outstanding with um, her speech so that was really exciting to hear also I just realized there's a massive garbage bag back there that you guys have had to be staring at this whole time um, that is clothes that I need to drop off their donation but yeah sorry that you've had to stare at a garbage bag um, also, Summer's directly behind me, so I can't really show you her um, in the car seat, but she is obviously here with me. Um, we are one, two, three, four, five, six, the seventh car in line right now, so that's just fantastic. Good morning, thanks for choosing our Starbucks. What can I get for you today? Hi, can I get a butter croissant and uh, not warmed and a tall uh, white chocolate mocha made with almond milk. I'm sorry, what was that? I couldn't really hear the drink. I just heard tall. Yeah, sorry. I'll, I'm going to pull up here. <laughs> um, a tall white chocolate mocha made with almond milk, please. Okay. And that's it. Alrighty, 835 is your total. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Ooh, <laughs> Ooh are you excited? You gonna get a butter croissant? So I got a white chocolate mocha. Uh, I love white chocolate mochas. Normally I don't get them because they're very sweet, but I'm kind of looking for something sweet. And I got it with almond milk because I can't have milk. I'm lactose intolerant, sort of. I don't know, I've never been tested, but let's just say milk, like cream, no bueno for me. While I'm sitting in line, I actually just remembered that I have money or like enough points to get a $5 gift card in my Fetch app. So I'm gonna do a $5 gift card to Starbucks in here. Uh, rewards, Starbucks. So get my $5 reward. Text 8233, validate. Um, I love this app. You just basically scan receipts and you earn points whenever you scan receipts. So, let's see, view gift card. So now I have $5 to Starbucks and I will use that towards my order today. I've shown this app before, but yeah, like I said, you basically scan your receipts and you get points for scanning receipts and then those points translate into gift cards. So. I'm glad I remembered that because now this is basically free, free coffee. Hello, 35, please. I have people want this. Thank you. I have this too. Okay. 335. Thank you. I think choosing Starbucks or the park will be right there. Oh, I don't have a mask. And then 81 cents. Oh, gosh. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Hi, I see a little baby face back there. <laughs> yes. Here is the butter croissant. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. Do you want your butter croissant, honey? Okay. Here you go. <laughs> Here you are. Did you want whipped cream on that? No. Oh, okay. You're all set. Is it, is, thank you. <laughs> forgot I knew there was something I forgot I normally say no whipped cream um, thankfully they didn't put it on so that's fantastic I'm driving now though so catch you later <sighs> you're heavy sweets she ate almost her entire croissant <gasps> yum yes I'm gonna put you down okay holy cow you're heavy oh no 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 Kip just ate the rest of her croissant. Thankfully, she doesn't seem upset. Oh my gosh. More, yeah, what if we have, oh, do you want a piece of cookie? Yeah, okay. Do you say please? No, no. You tell him no. Kip's in jail. 
Kippy. You can't eat our food. Here you go. Yeah, he won't eat it. He's in jail. I think I have a package, Kip. I'm gonna move you down to your little bed here. Move, move, and move. He's got a bed down here, so it's not that depressing. He's not actually in jail. Don't come at me. Oh! It's a young living package. Yay! Let's go unbox it. Yay! Mail time! We also got her one of those Montessori stools, so I might try to put that together today. Mm. Hi, buddy. Mm. You want more cookie? Oh my goodness. Can you say please? Can you say please? No, no, no. Yeah, no, no, to the dog. He can't get it. Can you say please? Uh. Okay. Let me take your sneakers off. Whew. You're heavy. Yeah, no, no. He can't get it, honey. I promise. Mmm. Oh, so fucking. Okay. Is it focused? Is it focused? Um, I noticed in the last vlog too the um everything was really grainy. I think that's just because, I don't know what the camera's doing right now, honestly. I think it's because it was so dark out that day. My whole house was really dark, so my camera was trying so hard to like brighten things. It got grainy. Um, so hopefully this video is better. I really want to make sure I'm putting out quality content for you guys. So I'm going to unbox my Young Living package. This is my... January essential rewards order. I processed it early. It normally processes on the 27th. You want more cookie? No, it's all gone. We ate it all. Oh, of course, now the lighting's freaking weird. I look yellow. Um, maybe I'll show you what I got. Is that better? I don't know. So, first thing, this is the Thieves Household Cleaner. Um, so this is the one I've talked about a lot where you can put a cap full of it in a like 16 ounce spray bottle of water and this is like an all purpose cleaner for your tabletops, mirrors, anything like that. So this will go a long way. I also got the Thieves Dish Soap. Oh, I got the Seedlings Baby Lotion. So Seedlings is the Young Living um, baby line. So this is their baby lotion. Summer has, um, some like bumpiness. I think it's called KP or Keratosporosis. I don't know how to say it, but I have it too on the backs of my arms and sometimes on my legs. So I'm hoping that this natural lotion might help. Uh, we always use Aveeno, but maybe, maybe this will help. I also got these Easy Breeze Awakening Shower Steamers. So they're like little discs that you put in the shower and as you're taking the hot shower, it just like steams up the aroma. These ones, what is the scent? Peppermint and Eucalyptus. This is an oil I actually got for one of you guys on Instagram who was looking to test out an oil for her, I think toddler. Um, so I opened up my membership to her so that she could order it. It is the Kid Sense Sleepy Ease. Um, so I got this and I'm gonna be sending it to her. If you're ever interested in Young Living, just DM me and we can chat about that. But yeah, this is gonna be sent to her. And then the last thing is this oil that I got. Um, Jade Lemon. I thought it'd be a fun spring scent to diffuse and it's one of the more affordable ones. I think it was like 11 bucks. Okay, it is lunch time for summer. Ready for lunch, honey? Yeah? Ooh, what do we have? We have olives, apple, and our favorite cream cheese sandwich and whole wheat bread. That's a new favorite of ours, isn't it? Okay. Are you doing a silly face? Baba. 
Bye bye blue, yes, that's right. <laughs> so we're almost ready to take a nap. Summer is playing with one of her favorite toys from the, yeah, bye bye. <laughs> Summer's playing with one of her favorite toys from the new play kit. And I think I'm gonna show you the play kit while she's napping. Just because if I tried to show you each toy while she's awake, she's gonna wanna just play with everything and it's just gonna be more difficult. So I have an idea to do like a fun little montage of everything that's included um, in the play kit. So I'm gonna do that once she's napping, which will be in about 10 minutes. Can you go put it away? Thank you. Go put it away, sweetie. Thank you. Can you get Prayer Bear and Doggy and go to your room? Let's get. Okay, let's go to your room. Good job. Okay, so Summer is down for her nap and I actually decided I want to do an Instagram Reels for the Love Every Play Kit. So I'm gonna film everything for that and then get the Instagram Reels up. I will edit in that Reels now so that you guys can see because I know I told you guys that I would show you what we got. to attempt oh gosh it's heavy <laughs> I'm gonna attempt to put together summer's stool pray for me well, this is the one we got I got it off Amazon it's from kids works uh, her grandpa and Gigi her grandma got her this for Christmas and it just came in and I haven't had a chance to put it together yet so we're gonna give it a go Here it is, you guys, all done, all by myself. <laughs> I think it's super, super cute. The only thing I haven't done yet is actually screw this piece in because um, it's adjustable and I don't know which one will make the most sense for her. So yeah, I put this together without any hiccups except for one. I ended up putting, I don't know, I like mixed one of those up so I had to take one off and then redo it, but it honestly wasn't that bad. And this is very sturdy. Um, it was definitely one of the more affordable options I could find for Montessori stools, and it was on Amazon, like I said, so I wasn't sure what we were gonna get, but I'm pleasantly surprised. Okay, so I thought I was gonna keep it there, but it juts out a little more than I thought. Can I turn it? This is way heavier, which is a good thing, um, but it's just way heavier than I expected. It's just really sturdy. What about this way? Just for when we're not using it. Yeah, that works. So I'll just leave it there, and then I can like bring it up to the counter while we're cooking or doing different things. 
So yeah, there it is. I never even drank my Starbucks. I think I might ice it because it's like room temperature. So if I put some ice on it, it might be good. So I think I'm going to do that now and then eat because I have had summer's leftovers. That is all I've eaten today. Summer is still completely passed out. Can you see her there? That's her head, body. Um, it's 2.10. Oop, low battery. Um, it's 2.10. She normally gets up at 2.30. I have her table all set up to make a card for my sister, and I have my sister's presents out here with some wrapping stuff, so I think I'm actually going to try and get the wrapping stuff done now before she's up. I think that'll just be easier, so I'll do that with you guys, and then I will show you how we're going to make a card. I got my sister a teapot. She's actually moving out. She's 24. Um, and she's moving out, so she asked for a lot of home stuff. And I got her a coffee uh, pour over filter and the coffee she likes. And then I also got her a hair crimper just for fun. Um, she has really wavy hair, and I think that this could like um, style it a little bit. I have this as well. Whenever you see me with crimped wavy hair, it's this one that I use. It's from Amazon. I'll leave a link for it down below. It looks like I think it's pretty cute you've got the silver um, with the pretty paper and then like a flower on top so that is number one then I'll do this exact same thing to this box and then I'm gonna put her coffee um, what is this called pour over thing and her coffee in this bag this is actually from a local store I'm gonna take some of the pretty paper and some of this paper too and, and I think like make a new front just so that this label isn't on there if you are local check out this place they're really cool but uh yeah I kind of want to make this look more like a birthday bag and not just like I reused a bag yeah that um was gonna be cuter but <laughs> I ran out of time because summer is awake and I just kind of wanted to get it done I mean it's I don't know she won't care my sister won't care but um that is what it is. These I think are super pretty, so that's fun. And I'm gonna go wake up Summer now and then clean up while she makes Aunt Kaylee a card. What you doing, Mama? Yes. Oh, hi. So Miss Summer didn't want her bottle, which has kind of been the new trend after our naps, right? Are we such a big girl now? Oh. Yeah. She just wanted her juice. I did just quickly want to show you what we've been doing to prep for potty training. So any single time I have to go to the bathroom, I bring her with me. And I did just bring up her little mini potty. She hasn't even really seen this yet, so we'll see what happens. But I'm going to go to the bathroom. Yay, mommy went potty. <gasps> Yay. And then we wash our hands. That's right. We wash our hands. So yeah, those are just the little things I've been doing just to kind of prep, just to make it like something that she'll hopefully want to do and make it easier. I don't know. We'll see. But uh, this little potty is from Delta Children. I can link it. I also got a potty cover for here. I don't know which route we're going to go yet, but I figured I would introduce her to this and maybe see if she just wants to sit on it. I was going to have her do the card over here, but I'm thinking let's try the new stool which I'm already using as a coat rack <laughs> okay so it's obviously meant to be more at a countertop but I think we can make this work yeah you want to you want to color yeah um and especially since we're not at her do you want to get up here okay come here come this way let's see if she can figure it out can you step up into here like a step let's see if she can do it you step yep step up now you have to go under this bar. Here. You 
to go under. Can you go under? Yes, good job. You can color now. Yeah, can you reach this? Can you reach? So maybe it'd be better at a countertop. I don't know, we'll see. Um, oh, you want it? Okay, so I'm gonna let her pick which card. Which rainbow card do you wanna use? This one, okay. So this is the one we're gonna use. And since we're not at her table that I don't really care about, um, I have this huge, I don't know, what's it called? Like a coloring mat thing that I put underneath her workstation so that we limit the amount of crayon on my table. So can you color this for Aunt Kaylee? Yeah. <laughs> you wanna color with blue? Where's the blue crayon? Yes. Good job. Good job, can you color? Color the card for Aunt Kaylee. So I think it'd definitely be better if we were at the countertop. So I'll just remember that for next time, but can you color more? Ah. Okay, color and we can even, Look. we can do stickers. I got these star stickers from Target. You can do stickers? Yeah. A star, yes. Mm. You want one? Yeah. Okay. Here, let me get you a star. Okay, mm. where do you want to put the star? <laughs> now she's drinking her bottle. So here's our finished card. You want to color again? Okay, you guys, so I'm gonna end the vlog here. Nick's gonna be home soon. We're gonna jump in the car and go for our little family dinner for my sister's birthday. I hope you enjoyed the vlog. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. I love you all so, so much, and I can't wait to see you in the next video. Bye.